Okay, so this video is going to be super niche, but it's basically how to hide, the, like the, it's either, it could be a white or a black section at the bottom of your website. And you'll notice this when probably you have a page that's made up of just one section. And that one section is maybe, let's say, yay big, but the screen is yay big. And basically, when that section doesn't fill the screen, Squarespace is just going to show a blank color to fill the rest of the screen. And usually, I think it, it's it's usually white or black. It could be another color, I can't remember. But basically, it's just this expanse of space. Um, and so we don't want that. Now, there's only one way that I know to do this. And basically, we need to fill that screen with that one section. So I'll walk you through what it looks like first, and then what it looks like once we fix it at the end. Let's go into pages, and then we'll add a new page. So blank page, we'll start from a fresh slate. Or is it a blank slate? Let's call it blank slate. How about that? Blank slate, lovely. So blank page, great. Now, this looks fine because there's a massive footer, but if I take out the footer, and then let's add a random section. So again, blank section, and we will make this section, uh, let's see, design, we'll make it small, okay? So we look at this, and then we scroll, and then let's just change the color here. So hit save, exit, okay? So we've got our content, or let, let's put some content in so you can see what I'm talking about. So edit, add a block, Let's add an image here, and we'll just grab like a random image. So let's put this, uh, if it loads up, I think Squarespace is being slow today. So we'll let that load in, and then let's put some text in. Great, amazing website, well done, Sam. Anyway, click save, exit. We've got just one section, so you know, you would figure this section should take up the whole page. But there's this big, and I said black or white, it, it must be the default background to your website. It gets put as the color here, and it just makes no sense. So let's edit this, and we'll make it medium. Okay, it looks like it almost fixes the problem. Go exit. But no, it's just made it slightly smaller. The only way that you can reliably make a section span the entire screen is by clicking large. And what large does is it makes your um, your section span the whole screen size, so 100 VH. And the only other thing that happens is you can see, I, th I think it's because we don't have a footer, but basically this is gonna show where the footer should go. So if you wanna get rid of that, just go into the cog, go into navigation and just turn off the footer if you don't have a footer. You do this, and then you can see, no matter how big the screen goes, this fills 100% of the page, which is great. Because then you don't have this weird, like, not juxtaposition, but this contrast between one section and then just this random color that makes no sense. Now, again, you might be watching this thinking, Sam, that's like stupidly niche. But I probably had this request on or from clients or on comments maybe 10 15 times and that's only over the past couple of years so i think this is an issue for a lot of people and they just need to explain to them like you need to have the section height as large to reliably stretch it to any uh, any screen size and this will fill any screen so if you're struggling with this that's what you need to do that's the only way <laughs> it's the only way i know to do it anyway so hopefully you found that useful if you did, please make sure to leave a like and hit subscribe. And if you want me to make your sections large and build your website, you can get in touch using the links in the description.